Container mode on. All right, I'm uh, I'm a little bit sick right now, and I, I really don't feel like doing a commentary right now. But you might be able to tell a little bit difference in my voice. It's because I'm sick. So if you're wondering why I sound a little different, it's because of that. So I tried to pick the shortest gameplay I had, and this is only like four or five minutes. So um, it'll do. I think I can make it through. But I wanted to bring some little difference, so we got capture the flag. And I forgot I sat up on this rock for like most of the game, but I do go like 17 and 1. Um, using the M60, which I want to talk about real quick. Yeah, it's definitely becoming one of my more favorite guns. Not for close range, but for far range. I actually like this probably better than the, like the M16 or something at long range. I don't know what it is about the M16, but that gun is it's just not for me. Um, I always seem to use it and stay far away from people, but I always seem to get into the close range situations, and I don't know how, don't know why, but that's just what happens, so. Man, I, I, I'm starting to, I haven't really talked that much this morning, and I'm starting to realize how deep my voice is right now. It, it sounds deep to me. Maybe I don't even need to make my voice lower on the commentary mode on. <laughs> it might already be deep enough. But, I can't remember if I mentioned if I go 17-1, but I go 17-1 this game. And I do run a flag with this freaking big uh, LMG. And, uh, oh yeah, I was talking about the M60 and why I like it. <coughs> so, I don't know why I like it. I don't, I don't freaking know. Oh, and that napalm right there, that's about to be a quad. I'll spoil that, I don't, I don't care. Ready? I'm gonna run, I'm gonna try and run this one, but I'm gonna die. Man, this is a really bad commentary. Hey, I, I gotta stop this. You know what, I'm not even gonna stop this. I'm just gonna keep going, but the M60 on it right now, I have the um, freaking, ah, uh, shoot, extended mags. No, I don't. I put that on, like, after this game, I think. I have extended mag. no. God, I'm an idiot. I just told myself a second ago I didn't have extended mags, and I'm already telling myself again that I do. I have on the grip. Shoot, do I have on the grip? Yeah, I have on the grip, and then I think I got Warlord after this game and put extended mags on it. So I wouldn't have to reload it all. It works pretty good, plus I was getting my Warlord. Quad! Quad! That might have been five, actually. No, it wasn't five. It was wide. But yeah. Um. <laughs> oh, there's another one. The only bad thing about the M60 is, it, is the rate of fire. But this is why I like it better than the M16, because it's it's super awesome for long range, because it barely has any recoil, or f at least for me, I don't know. Oh, people might disagree, I don't know. But to me, it feels like the recoil is really controllable at long range. Plus, when you're in uh, close range situations, it's a automatic gun, so it's a lot better at close range. Even though it's rate of fire is bad, I still win more close range gunfights with this than I would ever the M16. Because the M16, to me, takes... I've, I've used the M16 quite a bit, and I don't think I've gotten one gameplay with it. You can look on any Black Ops video I have, and I probably don't have an M16 video. And I doubt I ever will, because I'm terrible with it. I feel like... Oh, and I switched to my pistol there, because I was watching T-Mart, and he said you run faster with it. So that's what I was doing. And it worked pretty good. I'm actually glad I watched that video. He definitely, I think he gives the best tips on YouTube in my opinion. And uh, that's the end of the game guys. Sorry I'm sick. 17-1. Uh, Commentary mode. Off.